Have you ever wanted to bend pipes freely and animate the thickness and size? Well, this is the tutorial for you. Let's get into it. All right, so the first step you want is select your default cube, press X, delete, press Shift A, and we're gonna use a circle. Then we're gonna press Shift A, and we're gonna use, you can use a path or a bezier, I don't really mind. I'm using a bezier, I'm scaling this out, making it nice and big. And then I'm going to the object data property of the bezier curve. And then I'm going to Geometry, and I'm going to Object, and I'm just going to select my Bezier Circle. It's going to look wonky, but if you select your Bezier Circle up here, and you press S, and you scale this in to a more reasonable size, a size that's fitting for you, there you have it. We have a beautiful pipe. Select your Bezier Curve, press Tab, go into Edit Mode, and you can pretty much freeform this, move it in any way you like, and make it rotate, do whatever you want. You've got full control over your pipe. It's loads of fun and you can always expand it by just by pressing E to make it longer and if you've got any steampunk pipe designs now you'll have full control over what you do but let's say you want to have certain parts thick versus certain parts small let's say we select this specific part here we press alt s and we can scale this part here to make it slightly thicker maybe the object that it needs to fit in needs to be thicker and just like that we have it so hopefully you enjoyed this quick tutorial on how to freeform and model pipes please don't forget to like and subscribe. Alt S is to make this big and small if you're wondering. Thank you so much for your time. Goodbye.